So this time I thought I'd choose a video that had a scarier thumbnail than the last one. If we go back, this one right here, uh, sounds from gaming. That's interesting, right? It catches your attention, but the thumbnail's kind of mad, bro. So I thought we'd watch something with like a scarier thumbnail like this one, like the newest, the recent ones. This one's actually almost the same as the other one. But this one leads, leaves me to believe that it's fucking fake. But we could just go for that one. Para que un banco, New was one six days ago. Fucking ass. Con Mercado Pago. Es ahora. Oh, two ads. You just love two ads. A mother and her up. baby right. are alone at home when something very unsettling is caught on camera. According to the mother, she has no words for this terrifying encounter. The mother writes, I thought I was hearing baby. things at first, <laughs> but then my back door motion detector went off. That's when I knew it was real. She further adds Ooh. that only she and her child live alone in this door. house. Jesus. So whatever was caught on camera had to be someone or something else. If no other child lives here, then who or what was captured? This is what was caught. What happened in the back door, right? We can't see it. We're gonna be able to see it. I like the hair color of her hair. What the fuck? It's the last. No, mate, you thought... So you only thought that was real when the back door alarm activated? You didn't... You didn't think nothing of the laugh, dude? <laughs> dude, I legit wouldn't have checked it out. Yeah, good. I wouldn't have left the kitchen. I would have got a knife at that... No fucking way, footsteps. Oh, hi. Oh, Out of shit. nowhere, a child's giggle is heard inside the house, but even more creepy. Bro, what scares me the most is footsteps, random footsteps. For me, seeing something like hearing something walk by but not seeing it is scary to me. Is the fact that her baby was already looking at the direction from where the laugh had come from. Oh shit. <laughs> Initially thinking it was just fuck? in her head, she turns away from the source of the voice, seeming less scared. When suddenly, the sound of and running you footsteps hear the is heard. Footsteps. That's messed it up. It is at this point that she begins that to realize that maybe someone or something is inside her house. It was only I after the motion mom, detector went off that she quickly shit. fled away from the scene. As we already know, there shouldn't be another child in the home. Yet, a kid's voice is heard inside. <laughs> this is a child she the forgot mom about. further no, mentions yeah, that she looked around son. the house <laughs> as one of her thoughts was that a kid had broken into her home. But after searching all over the place, nah, there was no trace of anyone there. Yeah, the of course, kid to it's not in. certain if a ghost a or an entity that? was caught on camera. But until more info is given, the question still remains. Just who or what info is... I can't forget about the fact that that kitchen looks messy AF, bro. What is she cooking over there? The stove? They look like ribs, bro. Some really messed given, up fucking meat. The question still remains. Just who or what was inside the house. That was a good a video. A family like in Mexico one. has been experiencing paranormal activity from hearing random knocks on their door Mexico, my and town, opening it to go. find no one there to seeing things inside their house move on their own. The family can't help but think that something very sinister is haunting them. Now for some reason, these odd occurrences didn't happen until one day they heard a random knock on their door. Mm. Ever since then. Yo, I'm not gonna lie. I just heard a knock. Until Wait, one day the video, they it? heard a random knock on their door. Oh my god, it was from the fucking video. Dickhead. Jesus Christ. Nah, mate, that is not alright, bro. That, I... Dude, 
oh, the, my fucking door, my fucking door in my room is to the right. And I heard that from the right side of my headphones. I thought someone was knocking on my door. And bro, I'm alone, bitch. <laughs> what the fuck? That's from the fucking Think video. Very that is sinister is haunting up. them. Dickhead. Now, for some reason, <laughs> these odd occurrences didn't happen until one day Wait, they heard a random again, knock on their door. Ever since... And that sounds so fucking realistic. It sounds like it's coming from outside and not from the video. Then, they would wake up late at night to strange noises and other so creepy occurrences up. that seemingly don't stop unless they are recognized. Given how often this occurs, the family has started recording these incidents. After being woken up once again by strange noises, a family member begins to record and captures the following. This mm. is what they caught. Son las... No sé si se Son las... las 3 de la mañana con un minuto. 3 de la mañana. Y mi hermana me acaba de levantar porque dice que se escuchan ruidos en el cuarto. Mi esposo y mi niña están dormidos. What is she, what is she here? Sí. Fucking that's dead AF, yeah, bro. Vamos a ir a ver qué se escucha. Over now that there's ghosts. Sí. Fucking let them be. No hay Can't nadie. Solamente estamos mi hermana, mi hija, mi esposo y yo. And your dead ass Aquí husband. en este cuarto... <laughs> Está solo porque en esos últimos días nadie mm, yeah. ha podido dormir aquí. Como podrán ver, el cuarto está totalmente solo y same, pues nadie duerme aquí. Solo estamos nosotros. Mm. Mi hermana dice que se escuchan cosas, pero Ay, me asusté. Pero no sé, pues no se oye nada. No sabe. <laughs> Oh, oh shit. Dude, beat the dad asleep. I mean, beat the dad to wake up, bro. I still have to fuck it on my dad. Levántate. Levántate porque allá. Le pega la puerta. No sé qué. It'd be cursed if the dad wakes up, gets off the cupboards, and he's just in his underwear. Imagine that. Vinimos a yo. Se escuchó la puerta. Se escuchó la puerta. Mira, acabamos de venir y no estaba así. Holy shit, that's nice. Todos los cajones están abiertos. All of the cupboards, cup drawers. Jesus. Oh, Dios. But where was the knocking from, though? All of a sudden, the bedroom cabinets are open. It's almost as though someone had ransacked the room before disappearing from sight. But the family knows it wasn't a person who did this, but rather, something mm. else. They continue to look around in confusion, trying to see if anything else had happened, when out of nowhere, this happens. Another knock? Don't wake the girl up, yeah, yeah, yeah. Don't do anything to the kid. <laughs> Jesus Christ. ¿Qué fue eso? Dude, the dad didn't even flinch. She just looked behind him. No hay nada. No hay nada. No hay There's no ghost lacking in there, bro. Just what exactly had caused the noise in the bathroom? Like with most occurrences, the family can't seem to explain it. But surprisingly, it was thereafter that the occurrences stopped. It would seem that the family no mm. longer experiences anything unusual. But then one night, the following takes place. The family is woken up by a shuffling noise coming from the same bedroom where the cabinets had been opened. They immediately begin to record when the following happens. Bandita, no, no, and I didn't come in. Shit! Maestra, Shut Pique the Laquia fuck up, bro. Okay, we just won this time, thank God. <gasps> the father's not there, bro. What kind of name is Sarai, bro? Who named her? I would never. Sarai, bro. 
Uh, that's a name I've never heard of. I'm sorry, fuck the scary shit. I'm still caught up on Sarai. What can I name that? I've never heard of it in my life. It's happening at 3 a.m., bro. It's a witching hour. It's a witching hour, man. The ghosts get freaky. And what is the dad working at 3 a.m.? Whatever. <laughs> Hug me, bro. Oh, I feel bad for him. No, but those girls are talking it out, bro. I'm impressed. What the fuck was that kind of noise? How do you make that noise? What the fuck was that? That is seriously messed up. This is a good video right here, bro. This is a good scary video. Yeah, we saw the curtain move, yeah? Bro, at this point, I'd be relieved if it was some, a, a, a robber. <laughs> so at least there's a, an explanation behind it, bro. This is some horror movie shit. You're gonna open that door. Are you gonna open it slowly? Oh, yes, you are. I thought it was gonna be like bang. Just open it immediately. Don't ask that. What the fuck is wrong with you? Can you see that there's someone over there, bro? No. Somehow, the curtain we'll moves back. on its own. Now, some think that a light breeze had made it move, which could be the case. But it still doesn't explain like the strange the banging noise that is heard, or why the dogs were barking non-stop. Maybe it is the case that somebody was messing with them, but other previous incidents make the family think otherwise. So then, just what exactly is going on inside this home? Like with most videos, there has yet to be a definitive answer to this question. I don't understand. This next this. video was shot by someone somebody over there. Who in the footage, Bitch, you opened the door, there's nobody there. The view of the river you still ask if there's someone there. All appears to be normal until the camera catches something from a distance. Upon zooming in, it becomes apparent that whatever was caught on camera had most I'm likely like ruined monster. the mood of the person recording. Now, there isn't that much info on the yeah, clip, bet. but it still nonetheless speaks for itself. This is what was captured. That is impressive, bro. Those waterfalls. Oh, that is eerie. What the fuck? He just gets swapped over and now he's drowning. <laughs> oh shit, there he is again. He disappears. <laughs> Maybe he's just asking for help, bro. <laughs> That's why he keeps going up and down, up and down. Not too far from the swept. camera, there appears to be someone or something That's bathing in though. the roaring rapids of the river. After being splashed by countless river waves, the figure all of a sudden vanishes. It's as though the waves had washed away the shadowy form, but then suddenly it comes back for a split yeah, second again. before being taken away by the river. Now, even if we don't know what the person behind the camera is saying, we can hear it in their voice how baffled they are by the strange figure in the distance. Yeah, Whoever, or whatever this is, has voice. yet to be known, but I'll leave it to you to decide as to whether or not it's something paranormal. 
Unfortunately, the lack of info on this video it makes it likely that we'll never know for sure. Fucking head. No. Oh, it's unskippable, you dickhead. A mountain climber from Mexico shares a chilling photo from his trip to the mountains. It was during a podcast that Jesus Mexico. Olivares nice. shared the image and recounted the story behind it. Doubtless, the picture is pretty creepy to say the least. In 2009, Olivares and a group of friends had traveled to one That's of the impressive. highest mountains in Mexico. The mountain is known as Pico like de Orizaba, which has an elevation so high above sea level that it's Pico nearly impossible Orizaba. to climb without an oxygen supply. Many believe that the mountain like is uninhabitable Mexican for Mount this Everest. reason, <laughs> and therefore lack civilization. However, many climbers have reported so seeing silhouettes of people by, right? and other strange shadow-like figures when going up the mountain. It's a fucking ghost town. While some think that this might have been other climbers in the area, many believe that this might have been the spirits of deceased individuals who tragically died during their climb. Found in Mexico's Pico de Arriba, oh, Jesus. Now Olivares admits to having seen things he couldn't explain. Perhaps this might Frozen have been the altitude on the sickness mountain kicking that in, is Mount as low levels that of oxygen well. can cause people to hallucinate. But Olivares is certain that what he saw wasn't him just seeing things, but in fact, something real. That's what they all say, and bro. And to prove it, I wasn't he has a photo. Shit. I wasn't imagining it. I in saw a podcast, it Olivares claims to have seen shadows and heard distant voices while he and his friends ascended the mountain. These occurrences would come and go, but eventually stop at a certain point. They would continue climbing, feeling less spooked, before later stopping to take photos. Now lots were taken, but one in particular would catch people's attention. After the trip was over, Olivares posted cool, the, the pics on his social media and called it a day. But then, the day after, a strange comment was the made comments. below one of his they photos, which read, Nice pic, but who's the kid in the background? Confused by the comment, <laughs> Olivares, in response, <laughs> asked, kids, man. What kid? To which they replied, The kid in the corner, who is that? Olivares takes a closer look at the photo. Oh, what the fuck? He immediately got goosebumps. Olivares assures us that he and his friends, all adults, were the only ones present at the site. Initially thinking that it was just a rock, he shrugged it off as a case of pareidolia, but upon closer examination, there is clearly a child's face. It doesn't make any sense that someone, let alone a child, would be this high up in the mountain by themselves. Only explanation he can yeah, think of is that this was up. a paranormal Fucking incident. Kids about breaking in. But of course, it is solely a theory among many others who've seen the picture. The photo continues to haunt him to this day, even though it was taken back in 2009, and the lack of an explanation reassures him that something paranormal occurred. Nah, bro, you're gonna be but scared always, because the kid is what do in you the think? picture. It was like a Did grown all of man. Did capture something paranormal? It's a fucking kid. Or might there be a rational explanation for this? Feel free to let me know what you think down below. If you caught something creepy on camera, or if there's any ghost videos you'd like me to check out and include in the next compilation, you can send them over to scaryvideos444 at gmail.com. That being said, let's get back to the video. So last video? Yeah, it is. Now this last video was submitted by Aaron Tipsy, who <gasps> states that a friend of his had oh, sent him a creepy fake. video. In my opinion, it might be fake. In it, Aaron's friend can be seen sleeping inside their bedroom when something downright terrifying is captured. It's close to midnight when the following happens. Bro, you see the thing on her left? That looks like a fucking face. What if that shit turns into a fucking face and gross eyes this, and shit? This is what was caught. I don't know what that is. Someone slipping next to her? <laughs> Cause down there it also looks like knees below the fucking... Oh my fucking god. What better way to induce insomnia than by watching a video like this? Now it's worth mentioning that this same what video can be fuck? found on TikTok. However, the context given for that video is different from the one that was sent to me. Aaron states that his friend has no recollection of ever doing this in their sleep, whereas the one on TikTok states that they were fully conscious when they did this. Whether conscious or not, yeah, it's the fake. imagery of this it's video fake, is still it? nonetheless pretty disturbing. Real or not, this here is a great source of nightmare fuel. I know, it just happens so fucking suddenly. Thanks and right at watching, the camera, too. And I hope you enjoyed. 
and I'm guessing the one on the right is the same. Dude, that is messed up. But if I saw that, if I saw myself doing that after wa after watching like the recording, I don't think I could ever sleep, bro, or sleep with next to anybody else, dude. Not like I do, anyways. <laughs> oh, it hurts, hurting me over here. I'm just roasting myself. That was fucked up, dude. Jesus.